channel. I am so excited for today's video. I'm going to be doing a 2021 clothing try on haul with a new year here. I am ready to revamp my wardrobe, start dressing like my dream person. I want to show up like my dream person in 2021. So I feel like a part of that is dressing as the person that I want to be. And that person dresses in my style. I dress fashionable, I dress bold. And basically if I like it, I wear it. The products shown in this video were gifted by Princess Polly. Princess Polly, if you guys are not new here, is one of my all time favorite clothing brands. Pretty much every single day I'm wearing their stuff. Literally right now I'm wearing a Princess Polly top and a Princess Polly romper. Their style is very similar to what my style is and they also just have so many options. So really whatever your style is now, ever like to express yourself, they probably have something that you like. My stuff you guys haven't noticed is kind of like all over the place. I feel like I have like 11 different styles but they all kind of just like come together and mesh into grace and that's okay. You don't have to pick just one aesthetic. Like you are your own aesthetic girl. So wear what you like. It doesn't just have to be one style and Princess Polly delivers with that. So, so before we really quick hop into the video, I wanted to share a few things about Princess Polly. Also, P.S. Sorry if the lighting is a little weird. It's really dark outside today and it's been cloudy in Missouri for like 12 years. So the hoping of getting good lighting, and it kind of just passed and I was like, you know what? I'm in the mood to sit and chat with you guys. So I'm gonna do it. Okay. But before I get chatty, because you know, I could go on a rant about anything. I wanted to share a few things for about Princess Polly, like I said before. Okay. So first of all, I have a discount code right now. It's great says for 20% off. We love a good deal. We love upgrading our style in the new year and expressing ourselves, but also not breaking the bank. And you guys can do that with my discount code. Okay. I have a few things I'm going to read off my phone just to make sure I get them correct because I want to get you guys the best deals possible. So first of all, Princess Polly ships from the in the United States, so free express shipping three to four days on US orders if you spend over $50, which I think is great because who likes paying for shipping? Wouldn't you rather, you know, spend a little more than $50 and get another shirt instead of paying for shipping? Like just, we all hate that. I could literally spend a hundred dollars and if there's like $10 shipping on it, I'm like, I'm out of here. But if I spend a hundred dollars on all shipping, I'm like, yes girl. So Princess Polly also offers afterpay, which is amazing. You love to hear it. And yeah, that's all I have to share without hopping straight on into the video. So let's get into these pieces because they are so cute and we are having some main character energy this year. Like we are dressing like this movie that is live is our show. So, you know, we're dressed in as our best selves. Okay. Clothing try on time and like haul and everything. Okay. So first up skirts. If you guys know anything about me, I'm a big skirt girl. So if you guys want to comment down below, comment down below if you're a skirt or pants girl either, or we stand you, but I'm definitely a skirt gal. So I did grab a few. First off, how cute is this? I am obsessed. You know what guys, if you guys watch my videos, I've been making videos for like four years. I went to a private high school where we quite literally wore skirts like this and I was really dramatic about it. And here I am now ordering plaid skirts, but I think they're so so cute like I love this trend so much the pleats are so fun I love this one specifically because it's stretchy so it's very flattering on your body and she's just she's super duper cute we stand her okay so and next we have another pleated skirt because I don't know about you guys but I will be in the pleated skirt trend far beyond however long it lasts because it is just so flattering I feel so cute I feel like a little poly pocket my aesthetic described is I just want to feel like a poly pocket I might be the only one but I love it and these skirts make me feel like that so I'm gonna keep wearing them but this one is this really pretty blue color I wear my pink pleated one from Princess Polly literally all the time like so much i actually weirdly like the skirt backwards so like wearing the pleated part in the front and then like the flat part in the back i think it's really flattering super duper cute i'm very into like light green light blue and light pink right now those are my power color moments so this skirt's gonna go with everything i have literally perfectly she's about to be worn every single day Okay, this next item, you guys, are gonna be like, girl, your style's kind of all over the place. But, like, I warned you guys, like, my aesthetic is just me. It does, it does not stick to one thing at all. I just, I don't think it ever will. These are very different than, you know, the pleated skirt trend, but I'm here for it. I'm really here for the leather stuff. I think it's so cute. I'm usually not a big shorts girl, so it's kind of like me branching out, trying to get, I don't know, expand my taste, not just wear skirts. I feel like shorts can be fun too. And I just also really like the flexible waistband. Once again, super comfy. You know, I can wear these out to dinner and no matter how much I order, by all the appetizers will be good. <laughs> Okay, this next piece, again, it's one of my current power colors, so we're gonna be feeling powerful. They are these 
bubblegum pink biker shorts like can you explain something that's more boss like i'm obsessed the texture of these is super interesting and very i don't know i feel like experimental style wise and very very fun i don't know if that's the right word for it but we're going with it all right and then it comes with this pink scrunchie which is super cute because i love like imagine this with a pink shirt with the pink scrunchie just like an all monochromatic i believe you call it outfit makes you feel to not overuse the word but to overuse the word like a main character so yes <laughs> Okay, so this next piece is my new power pant. I am obsessed. I want to wear these for a shoot I'm going to do for a brand I'm launching. The fit is super duper flattering. They're more high-waisted, which I love. I will never get on board with the low-rise thing. I just, I can't do it. It's just not me. I love the high-waisted on these pants. I love that the back is scrunchy. It's more flattering. I don't know. I just feel like these make me feel super cute, make me feel in charge powerful and like a boss lady which we all deserve to feel like boss ladies in 2021 okay this purse i have been eyeing for so long i wanted it so bad i think it's so fashionable stylish let me just go ahead and show you guys but then emma chamberlain said i needed it so then i really really needed it guys i love this so much i'm so here for the tiny bag trend again like i said my goal in life is to be a Polly Pocket-esque human being. That is me. And this bag makes me feel like that. And also, I'll just show you guys. It comes with this little attachable strap moment, which is very, very trendy right now. I'm definitely going to be putting this on here. It's also just really great when you don't always, like... We're not always, like, living in a movie. Sometimes you need a little shoulder strap for, like, real-life stuff. So, she's just perfect. She, she does it all. And also, this light blue color. I would happily marry this color. I love it. <laughs> So next I got this tank top. I'm obsessed with it. I'm really, really here for the nude trend. I just feel very much like a famous person when I wear it. Does anybody else relate to that? Like I wear my nude baggy hoodie and I'm like, and for what? Like, and for what, Grace? But yeah, needless to say, I really like this shirt and I like the little tag on the back. I feel like that's a really, really nice detail. We're into the details right now. Okay guys, this next shirt is serving me Bridgerton vibes and we are here for it. I'm just trying to feel like a princess even though I'm literally living at my parents' house in my childhood bedroom. But like, Bridgerton princess vibes, you know what I'm saying? I think this is so cute. I also think it would be cute to wear to like football games next year if like real life is back again. But I love the mesh sleeves. I love the little poof moment. The detailing is just everything. I love the like texture of this. It's hard to describe, but... I just overall she's so great I love that it's like stiff and it has this little angle I this is everything I'd ever want in a shirt and the back is like mesh see-through and I had no idea and that just makes me feel even more like a princess so okay up next I've been wanting to experiment with this trend and I don't know why I waited so long because I am so excited to wear this the sweater vest trend this with a turtleneck and a tennis skirt is going to be a vibe with my new princess poly bag it's everything like I said this green color is one of my power colors right now overall she's so cute she has that tan again so I kind of feel cooler than I am this is just everything I Okay, up next we have this tank top, which I feel like is just a staple for every girl's closet. Everyone needs something like this. This is kind of like a trendy rendition of a plain black tank. It's super duper flexible, thin fabric, which will be really, really great for spring. I love how it literally just looks like it's inside out. That trend is something I am here for. And I just can wear this so many ways and I know I'm going to get my use out of this. So that's why this top is just, I don't know, a staple. Okay, these pants are my newest obsession. These could change me from a skirt girl to a pant girl, and that's a lot to say, but I feel like I'm gonna wear these so much. So they're high-waisted, first of all, which again, check, that makes me wanna wear them 10 times more. They're wide leg and the knees have ribs. How cute are these? I think this will be really, really cute for Mizzou stuff next year and also just for like normal life. Like wearing these to go get some coffee is a vibe. I love the frayed ends. Everything about these is beautiful. We stand them. They're called the CC Hammer Wide Leg Knee Rip Jeans. And they're amazing. I love. Them. 
I picked up these super duper cute little nail stickers. I am so excited. I'm going to do my nails immediately after filming this video and I'm going to be like a little Pinterest aesthetic queen. So I've been wanting a necklace like this for so long and I could not find an affordable option of what my mind was wanting for so long and I finally found it. I think it's so, so, so cute. I love the butterfly. I love that it's tinier on my neck. I think layering this with my everyday necklace is going to be great. That's going to become one of my everyday ones. It just feels like really, really nice quality. You don't have to break the bank to have this stylish moment. And I'm just here for her. I love. So something I want to integrate more into my style this year is sunglasses. I always see fashion bloggers having their moment in sunglasses on Instagram. And for some reason, I never do that. I like never literally wear sunglasses. I have a few pairs, but I don't know. I'm not obsessed with any that I currently have. They're all kind of older. And these are what the vibe we were looking for. I think these are so, so, so fun. I can't wait to wear these to go get coffee and just feel like I'm main character. You know the vibe. We know the vibe. I love it. I'm here for it. Okay, really quick before I show you guys the last item. I did actually get this shirt I'm wearing right now with this order. I'm obsessed. I've already worn it twice and I've had these clothes for like three days. It's a color that I'm really here for right now. I love the light purple pastel vibe. And also it has like the scrunchy type thing, which just makes it feel very flattering. It's that like ribbed material. So I don't know. I love her. I've worn her a lot of times. But the next thing, this just goes again to show you guys, like, my style's all over the place. But if I like it, I wear it. This is very different than my other pieces, but I'm obsessed. I think this is so perfect for everyday wear, wearing the classes when they start again. Honestly, wearing this with biker shorts and sunglasses kind of dresses it up and makes it more fun. I just love this a lot. I did size up and I got a size 12 just because I wanted it to be long and baggy. I don't know who can pull off the biker shorts with like a crop shirt you know what? all of you guys probably can but something about me with a crop shirt and biker shorts just makes me kind of uncomfy and wearing like a big short with the biker shorts peeking out is more my comfort and my vibe so that's what i'll be doing with this shirt and i really 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 like it that is all for today's try on haul thank you princess polly for sending these pieces over comment down below what aesthetic or vibe you're going for this year maybe you're going back to the old visco style see it's kind of making a comeback pinterest style if you're kind of trying to be edgy you know very dainty poly pocket my style that i made up a name for which is just whatever i would wear i call it that so yeah let me know down below i love experimenting with new styles that's also something you guys can do this year like if you don't have a vibe yet or you want a specific vibe one wear anything that you like but two experimenting with different vibes of clothes like this shirt and then wearing like little pink biker shorts that's fun that's like part of growing up is trying out all the different ways of dressing and seeing what makes you feel confident because that's the cool part of fashion and the cool part of getting dressed in the morning like it doesn't have to be something that you dread it can be something that makes you excited and feel creative so yeah all right i'm gonna go ahead and head out because i know i get very chatty in these videos but i just love sitting down and talking to you guys i'm super casual there i'm literally sitting against my closet on the floor and we're here for it so yeah i hope you guys have the best day ever whenever you guys are watching this i hope things are looking up for you guys this year is going to be your year like yes you guys are bosses and i'll see you guys in my next video